Yo, say sexy baby. Hi, and welcome to episode two of John Clark Size Sexy. Today, as you can see, I'm sporting a, a new haircut. People have been taking a piss, they look like Dumb and Dumber, but I think it looks rather nice. Don't you? Anyway, today I'm, um, I'm touching on body transformations. Okay. Body transformations uh, is something that I do as part of a package for my personal training. Um, over the past two years, I've had some absolutely brilliant transformations, if I do say so myself, both online and face to face. And I say the two most popular are my old pal Chris Barnes. And Simon Stubbs. Okay, I'm gonna to touch on Simon's first. Simon Stubbs came to me January of this year. He was basically in a bit of a mess. Um, I'm sure he won't mind me saying. He was drinking far too much, eating far too much, and well overweight. Just, just poor lifestyle, really. Uh, he was also, he, his health wasn't the best. So I think that was his last resort. Um, he came to me, he signed up for my New Year's body transformation. He came to me in January, and by the middle of April, he'd lost over five stay with myself. He looked that good that local media contacted us and that's going to be Evening Post. Also the local radio station and as a result we ended up having our pictures taken and a big article, double, double page spread article in the Nottingham Evening Post. After this Simon didn't give up, he wanted to carry on, uh, wanted to go to the next stage. So we entered phase two of the body transformations and he looked really, really good. Added more muscle tissue, lost more weight. And again, um, local media contacted us, but not only local media, see people don't know this, also the Sun newspaper contacted Simon. At the moment, Simon now has an agent following this. People are gonna be shocked by this, but I don't think he wanted to say anything, but oh well. Uh, sorry, Simon. Um, he's now got an agent uh, and a number of magazines uh, have offered him deals that he hasn't signed up to yet. The reason being, <laughs> he's now signed up again with me and he's gone into phase three. So we've got another photo shoot in the beginning of December this year. I think we've got about six weeks left. Today I've just changed his diet. It's getting pretty ruthless now for him, lots of cardio, but still lots of food. That's the secret behind it. Um, so yeah, he's, he's done really well, going from being in a mess to now having an agent by the end of the year. The thing is, results don't lie. This is what I'm gonna to touch on. I've had some cracking results. Simon's brother, Mark Stubbs, he's lost nearly six stone. Chris Barnes, he lost nearly four stone. Um, Adam Collins, the local celebrity, he, he looked absolutely brilliant for his film, Outlawed. He, he, Adam's done really, really well for himself. He, he just had his film premiere in Nottingham City Centre. That made headlines. Uh, he's a cracking lad, Adam. He's doing really well. Uh, I've had Edward Whitehead, I've had lots and lots, Bobby Chima, he just goes on and on. As I say, results don't lie. If anyone goes on my Instagram, John Clark underscore PT, they will see all my body transformations, including the ones that made local headlines. The reason I'm switching on body, body transformations today is because as Christmas approaches and as January approaches, uh, people will overeat. They'll drink too much alcohol, they'll end up feeling like shit, uh, and then they'll contact their personal trainer and they'll expect them to work miracles. When people come to me, because the transformations have been so good, they expect it to be easy and they think I've got a magic pill or a secret that I'm gonna give them and transform the body. Well, they're wrong because it's absolutely grueling hard work. I'm renowned for my style of training. Some people don't like it, some people do. My training uh, methods are ruthless, but it gets results. Time and time again, I go into gyms and I see personal trainer putting a pain client through the paces with pathetic exercises, simple cable exercises, um, isolation exercises, keep them in the comfort zone, just keep them ticking over, keep taking the money, the hard-earned money that they could put 
buy food where to put on the table for the wife and kids or vice versa or food or money that they could just go on holiday with. Um, for me, it's about results. I, I am ruthless in my trading methods, but I'm also bloody good as well. And as I say, results don't lie. So basically what, what, what I want to say to people is, is if you're thinking of signing up for my body transformation, just remember it's hard work. But with me, you will get 100%. And by that is I get a lot of job satisfaction. Now that sounds cheesy. If someone was to say that to me or I'd see someone on video like this, I'd think what a load of shit. But for me, you've got to remember is I get more work from my results. And you're only as good as your last result you put out. I'd also get a lot of job satisfaction because I like changing people's lives. Same as Simon, same as Chris Barnes, same as Bobby Chibo is coming up, same as Mark Stubbs. You know, the, the, the list goes on. Um, so all I want to say is if, if, you, if you're coming on the transformation course, right, just give it your best, give it your 100%. You know, do not expect to come on the transformation course and it's going to be a walk in the park. I'm going to give you a diet. I'm going to give you a few supplements to take and I'm going to keep you in your comfort, comfort zone. Well, I'm not. You know, I'm, I'm going to really put you through it because I want you to succeed at the end of the day and you're paying good money for it. So what I'm going to do is now, I'm going to do a, a short little interview I did with Simon Stubbs. Okay, this is um, the guy I spoke about earlier who lost five stone in four months. Um, I just wanted to give him a little bit of an overview about what he went through on his transformation. Team six. Right, this sexy bugger is uh, Simon Pretty Boy Stubbs, one of my clients. Uh, Simon lost over five stone, as I said earlier. Uh, on my body transformation, it was within four months. Here is his pictures from the local media. Look at that, incredible but true. This is the same man. Da -da 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 -da. Look at the sexy bugger. And this is another article of the dead. Simon, 42, feeling unreal after speedy weight loss. And there is our picture. Simon Stubbs before and after with sexy, hot personal trainer, John Clark and the former British bodybuilding champion. Yeah, baby, that's me. Right, Simon. Yes, John. Right, so we just want to talk a little bit about your body transformation. I'm not going into great detail because we'll, we'll do that um, over the next few weeks. Um, but just give us a little overview of how long it took and uh, what you went through. Well, I got hold of uh, saw John doing his work early, late last year. Yeah. Um, a good friend of mine, Chris, has done a transformation. Oh, not Chris Barnes. Yeah. And the guy, wow. that's, the, the guy that's gone fat again. Sorry, Barnes. Eh? <laughs> but he's on the comeback. He's on the comeback. I want to do that, and I showed him my wife Emma the pictures of Chris because I'm going to do that one day. So no, never, never, and all as soon as you get that. Yeah. Um, 18 stones were short off. Um, phone John at Christmas. I want to start transformation in January. And from then on, just smash the hell out of it. Um, Chris once said to me, just do everything John tells you to do. If he tells you to eat shit, you eat shit. Yeah, and that's what, exactly what I did. Did every program he did, it's a diet, stuck to it, um, trained hard. Um, at first, training was hard because it was like... You didn't want to come back after your first day, did you? Recovery was horrible. Legs um, on your first day? Yeah, killed me. Um, but after three, three to four weeks, I managed to do it every day. And since then, it's been every day, the day off in the week since then. Yeah. Um, we're going to Crete in August, so that was the plan to get a side sexy for my whole day. Yeah, baby. Um, but it all happened a little bit more quicker than that. Um, to start January the 4th, um, by April the 4th was the first time I did the papers. And I'm just going to go back onto the papers. This was Simon. That's, that's, that's the oldest one. Last year. This is the sexy bugger a year later. Do, 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 do. Yeah, big man. Right. So we're going to get to more detail in the next few weeks. So do you want to tell people what our next aim is now? Um, for the past three or four months, I've not really moved much. I've lost yep. a bit more weight, slowly gaining muscle. But then John says to us, no, where are you going to go from now? Um, I want to get to that proper shredded look, real full abs a lot. So John put me another program out, um, lifting heavier weights now. Diet, lots of food, um, which is not what I'm used to. Um, Given this diet, I thought, bloody hell, what? I'm not going to manage that. 
but um, did it the first week, put a pound on. What's happened this week? Expected. expected. Um, go back to give my weight to John twice a week, Saturday and Wednesday. Um, weighed in this morning, Wednesday, and I was two pound down. Yeah, so baby! The credit. magician knows. Um, just loving the training at the moment. It's not, you used to be the ball leg and short. Now I'm enjoying it because I'm seeing the results. Yeah, you're Day strong, isn't it? I'm getting stronger every day. It's just unreal. The comfort I'm getting, it's just amazing. Um, I can't stop looking in the mirror at myself at the moment. Yeah, we just bloody know that, don't we, Bazo? <laughs> But, um, so yeah, the package that we're going to look for this time is a much bigger, fuller, harder, more ripped bodybuilding look. Yeah, I mean, John said to me, sort of five weeks into the original transformation, one day, so I'm going to get one stable. Right. Now, maybe, it could be a possible. Maybe, maybe, we're going to do it. Yeah, we'll see how this Sorry, Emma Scobbs, yeah. this is Simon's wife, but she, yeah. <laughs> yeah we we'll be looking into that next year. Um, I just love, love the where we've got to stick to a plan. I'm, I'm so dedicated. I was the first time I am there. And I mean, John sees one me cooking this morning, all the meals, it's getting prepped up. Yeah, um, and he even cooks, what a bloody nice house as well. He, he even cooks, look, his missus is corn uh, sausages. And let's not forget, the fridge is also full of beer. <laughs> yeah, this is the video bar. This is where it all used to happen, this is where I got fat. Nah, 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 nah. Size sexy. Yeah. Can we meet my dog, Alfred? These are the, oh, look at him. See, this is this is the dog version of me, Scrappy-Doo. I know it feels to be small, mate. This is my fridge, this is where it all happens. We've got beef steak there ready, we've got veggies ready. Look at this man, Sweet yes. potato, chicken, steak to cook for tomorrow. Uh, sweet potatoes, quite healthy looking fridge. That's mint, mate. Right, and now back to reality, I've got to go for physio, so we'll continue this fair run next week. We'll probably see in the gym tomorrow. Yeah, size sexy baby. Yeah, thank you. Over and out. Size sexy baby.